Good afternoon, everyone. I'd like to share with you how I sold 48,000 software licenses to the FBI. Um, let's begin with what I can't tell you. What I can't tell you, obviously, is how the FBI precisely uses these software licenses. Because I don't know. Even if I did know, I couldn't tell you. And if I was to tell you, I would have to kill you. <laughs> and, you know, looking at the large number of you today, it's going to be a bit tricky. What I also want to emphasize here is that user lock The software we designed that's used by the uh, FBI has absolutely nothing to do with the current NSA PRISM privacy concerns. It's not a big brother tool. Censorship. Alors, non seulement je suis le seul speaker qui ne s'exprime pas dans sa langue maternelle, mais en plus le seul à qui il arrive des problèmes techniques. Je rêve. Ouais, bah là, il vaut mieux petit que moi, hein, je vous rassure. Si vous voulez que le temps comme ça dure, demandez-le encore une fois. <coughs> Parce que là, on les voit, mais pas là. Bon, sinon, vous montez tous avec moi sur la scène et vous regardez le petit écran. Non mais ça je le redis pas parce que je pense que tout le monde a compris. So, what I also want to emphasize here is that user lock, the software we design and that's uh, used by the FBI, has absolutely nothing to do with any current PRISM NSA uh, privacy concerns. It's not a uh, big brother tool, but a solution to protect companies information. But, as Napoleon once said, a picture is worth a thousand words. So a movie must be worth, what, a million? Let's watch one together. What can you do to reduce the attack surface of your Windows network? How can you mitigate increasing insider threats? With UserLock, a unique enterprise solution that restricts and controls user access to protect your Windows network. Organizations across the world trust and rely on UserLock to monitor, control and secure access for over 1 million users, implement CERT best practices and to get compliant. So how does it work? Logins are the first line of defense for any Windows network. UserLock takes security controls far beyond native Windows functionality by limiting concurrent logins and restricting users according to customized access policies. 
Restrictions can be enforced across all session types, including Wi-Fi, and defined according to user, user group, or organizational unit. What's more, this new level of security will stop rogue users seamlessly using valid credentials, prevent users from sharing passwords, offer security to control a wireless network, and the adoption of BYOD. With restrictions set, you're in control. UserLock monitors all Active Directory sessions in real time and will alert you of suspicious or disruptive behavior so you can instantly react with appropriate measures. By recording all access events, UserLock also offers comprehensive and detailed insights to support IT forensics. Installed in only minutes on a standard Windows server, the modern interface is intuitive and easy to use. From its web interface, you can also manage user lock remotely and quickly respond to any security threat at any time and from anywhere. Secure your Windows network. Download the fully functional 30-day free trial of user lock today. So, how did this story begin? And how will I tell it to you? Because I don't want to bore you, at least try not to. So an idea crossed my mind. Who are perhaps the greatest visual storytellers? Movie makers, right? So I tried and crafted a movie style presentation. Here we go. I started IS decisions back in 2000 driven by two main motivations. First, after many years living in corporate land, I wanted to come back here to the Basque Coast where I was born and raised, and frankly, get to surf more. <laughs> Second, I had and still have the conviction that enterprise security software didn't need to be cumbersome how to install, difficult to manage, and require an army of costly third-party engineers to just get it up and running. So I moved back to Biarritz and grouped together a small team of talented developers, and we set about creating compelling security software. My vision of compelling software is that it must offer the best solution to a real problem and to be as sexy and easy to use as the software we use in our social lives. Obviously, it was a long journey. It took 10 years, like two tons of pizza, and a lot of coke to bring about the vision. Of course, when I say coke, it's the beverage, not the narcotic, even though the DEA is also one of our customers now. In 2010, we started to gain momentum as more and more companies worldwide shared our vision, tried our products, purchased them, and began to spread the word. At this time, we quickly saw that while being a small French startup, far from the Silicon Valley or the Boston area or even Israel, we could still compete internationally and win key clients. How? Well, obviously, we are a high-tech company, and we use the latest technologies to support our business and tell our story. So, yes, we tweet, we Skype, we Yammer, we SharePoint, we LinkedIn, we Hangout, we Trello, we Use a Voice, we Blog, we Spiceworks, we know our penguins from our pandas, but that's not what I believe makes us different. What I believe makes us different is people. IS Decisions team is multinational, French of course, but also American, British, Spanish, and Chinese. And that cultural diversity generates a rich exchange of different ideas and points of view, which maximizes our creativity. We're proud of the fact that our diversity is not only cultural, but extends to gender, as more than half of IS decision staff are women. We also, gathers, we also gather generations X and Y, from smart young developers in their early 20s, 
right through an old fart of CEO like myself. This rich diversity is what makes us really different in every area of our business. Software design, marketing approach, sales communication, and corporate culture. I also believe we all benefit from living and working on the Basque Coast in such an inspiring environment. Surrounded by beautiful beaches, mountains, countryside, we achieve a work-life balance and avoid the stress of inner city living. In fact, our location here in Biarritz really helps to attract and retain qualified and engaged team members. So, it's my assumption that serving up a cocktail, one part vision, one part serious software, one part great people, plus a dash of cool lifestyle, is what enticed the FBI to choose IS decisions. So what's next? We've got ourselves two exciting challenges for the near future. We're taking the high road to China. It's such a huge and fast-growing market. Did you know, for example, that the GDP of the city of Shanghai is the equivalent of the GDP of the country of Brazil? We've been preparing to launch in China for 12 months. We now have a Chinese website, a team based in Shanghai, and the beginning of a local partner network. I'll be in Shanghai and Beijing next week to officially begin our new Asian adventure. Our second challenge is the cloud, as in cloud computing, of course. This game changer redefines what's possible in the IT business, but also creates new and growing security concerns. And we want to address these new concerns once again with innovative software solutions. It's going to be difficult, but hey, no pain, no gain. Huh? So I hope finally that, like the FBI, the Chinese will appreciate our special Basque cocktail and that we can duplicate our current success with the cloud. Thank you, good night, and good luck to you.